So first things first, I got a haircut. Ah, so excited. Uh, my almost one year old was getting a little grabby and I've had short hair like my whole life except the last five years when I thought I'm going to grow it out, be luxurious, I'll be able to put it up and do all kinds of things. I never did anything with it. It was just in a low pony forever and then I just kind of got tired of it because it's really hot in Texas. So I chopped it off and thanks to baby it's wavy now. So that's exciting. And uh, so there's that. Yay! I'm really excited. Um, so next disclaimer, because of said hair, um, <laughs> I have a lot of exciting things to show you guys. So I'm going to be filming three videos at once. And usually I change my lipstick and my shirt when I do a whole bunch of videos at once to like have this illusion of different videos. But since I'm terrified of ruining this newly wavy hair that I don't know how to take care of. Um, I don't want to change clothes and mess it up. So I'm going to be in this shirt for the next like month on my channel. So just letting you know in advance. <laughs> okay, so um, first thing I want to talk about is uh, my husband was on a vacation for a week uh, between jobs. He just started a new job. We're really excited. And um, so we took some time off and went to all our favorite geeky and cute places in Austin and uh, basically just got everything. So I wanted to show you kind of a geeky Austin haul. Um, so yeah, so first thing are the cutest things ever. Um, we went to Guzu Gallery, as we do. I've done lots of other videos of favorites and stuff. Um, we always go to Austin Books and Comics, Guzu Gallery, and Outlaw Moon. They're all in the same uh, strip mall, and uh, they're all owned by the same people. It's like our little geeky haven uh, in Austin. And Guzu Gallery has lots of designer toys and imported toys and blind boxes and stuff like that. And they have a little art gallery in the back, um, so local artists um, will put up shows and stuff so it's really cool but they started getting more Sailor Moon things and they have the individual Chibi Moon and Sailor Moon Yukata. Oh so cute! I have the full set of all of the sailors um, and I think I hollered about it in a favorites video recently but so excited like look at this Chibi Moon. I hope you can really see I hope there's not too much of a glare. But she's so cute. Back. Look at that. Oh my goodness. And then there's that. Oh. And then, oh, I'm so excited I'm throwing her around. Okay. And then there's Sailor Moon, her little red one. Look how precious. Oh, she's so good. I just, this whole line of, uh, the petite charas is incredible. It's the cutest, cutest thing, and I already have my petite charas are like overflowing over there behind you. Uh, so I'm gonna have to figure out a new display thing for them because they're everywhere. But I couldn't uh, pass these up. These were $14.99 at Guzu Gallery, so get your butt down there. Um, I don't know how hard they are to find online. I haven't looked for them recently, but I feel like they were more expensive than that last time I looked. Um, so another couple of things, um, so Disney Infinity, I'm sad that it's going away. I never played it, I didn't really care for the game, but I loved the figures that came with it, and uh, a lot of them have been going on sale because that's kind of defunct now, which is really sad. Um, because I don't know who was doing their figures, but they're amazing, and I recently, Turks, stop messing with my tripod. Um, I recently got Poe, Dameron, and Han Solo, so my two dreamy Star Wars dudes. Uh, that was exciting. And then Toys R Us is having a sale, or at least they were around when I filmed this, um, for it's buy one get two free. So stop doing that, Turks. So Andy got the Hulkbuster, which is really great. And then I got an Aladdin. And I got a Minnie Mouse. So cute, right? That was exciting. Thanks, Toys R Us, for buy one, get two free. They're kind of running out of, of good ones. Um, nobody wants Spot from The Good Dinosaur. I'm sorry. Uh, the movie did make me cry, but I did not like it. 
Um, okay, and also, we just ordered online a Princess Leia that I've been wanting so badly. So she's going to go up. Oh my goodness, charcoal bean. I am so sorry. Come here. Just because you're being a toot, you're going to have to be on camera. Look at this bad cat. He's the worst. Get out of here. Um, so, I have Princess Leia. <laughs> and she's going to go on my shelf because I love her and she's perfect. And speaking of Princess Leia, we also got whoosh, General Leia from... I forgot where I got her. We've been everywhere. Oh, I got her at Wonko's. There's a place um, North Austin called Wonko's. And they have lots of vintage toys and stuff. And they have pops, too. So, you can get tons of, like, old Star Trek and Star Wars stuff. And they do games, uh, like tabletop games and stuff, kind of like Outlaw Moon does. Um, but they had general Leia, and I was excited. Because I need everything Leia ever forever. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. It is so shaky. This cat, like, has to be on this one leg of my tripod right now. Because he's the worst. Cut it out. Okay, so soon, soon thing, we also went to Toys R Us, as we do, and um, found a genie. Series 3 has been so difficult for me. I have approximately 10 bajillion Alice's and White Rabbits from the blind bags. Uh, only half a bajillion Donald's. All I want in the whole world is the genie and the jasmine. I would be so happy. So if anyone has extras, hit me up because I will trade you all of the Alice's in the world for it. Um, but I was really excited to find this big fat genie, so I had to get him. It's the only one. <laughs> I've had such bad luck with Series 3. It's such a bummer. Um, but I had amazing luck at Toys R Us. This is the last thing. This is my piece de resistance. Dun 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 dun! You guys, okay, so it has, on the back, it's got the calendar, so it's like this whole cut out big thing, right? And I assume this just flops down, the front just flops down, um, but it's got um, six large figures with six holiday headpieces, six medium figures in holiday attire, and six small figures and six holiday themed stackable accessories. You guys, I love Christmas time and I love Tsum Tsums. So this is like the greatest thing ever. Uh, so I think my studio is gonna have to be like a Christmas candy cutie wonderland for, <laughs> for the holidays because oh, I'm so excited. So good. So, pretty good haul for the week, right, you guys? Like, not too crazy, uh, but still super fun. Um, Austin has lots of really great places to buy geeky and cute things, so I hope you go and visit uh, some of the spots. Love ABC, Guzu, Outlaw Moon. There's also Sideshow around the corner, and that's kind of their more discount um, sale store. And uh, there's Wonko's. And of course, you know, I love Terror Toys and Dragon Slayer, and uh, it's, it's just a really great town to live in if you're a member of every fandom ever. So, <laughs> um, so I hope you like this. Uh, I hope you can get your hands on some of this cute stuff, because it's great. Yay! And I will see you next week. Bye!